Dallas is playing with all our cords behind the TV. You know better. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday season and a happy new year. Um, so today, <laughs> we're doing a very fun couples challenge. What is it called, babe? It's called... The Newlywed oh, Game. Newlywed Game. We've been married for four and a half months, almost five months, January 14th. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna do a couples challenge. So pretty much we're just gonna ask each other questions and whoever gets the question wrong, unfortunately is gonna get creamed in the face. You wanna ask a question? <laughs> Isn't she getting big if you watched the first video? I know, she is gigantic. Look how big she is. She's a full grown tiger. Mm -hmm. We just kiss her all day. Okay, so we're gonna call it How Well Do We Know Each Other? And I did my makeup because I'm determined that I'm not gonna get any of these questions wrong. And I'm not gonna get whipped cream pied in the face. I'm it's gonna get them all right. Oh no. And what are the rules? The rules are we have our answers written down so we can't change the answers yeah, you conveniently. Can't change them. And the other rules are. Once you answer it, that's your answer. Mm -hmm. You can't be hopping around yep. different answers. So once you say it, it's it. You gotta look final with answer. the final answer. Is that your final answer? Then maybe that's what we'll do. Is that your final answer? That's good. Wow. Yes or no? Okay. So who wants to start? You want to start? I'll no, start. I'll start. I'll start. <laughs> okay. All right. My first question is for you, honey bunny. What is my biggest fear? Her biggest fear, mm. she's very brave. So I know that she doesn't have a lot of fears in her life. I do. Mm. I have lots of fears. So there's like a joking one that I could say and there's like a serious like deep one. I'm gonna say <laughs> cockroaches. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> final answer. <laughs> no. It's not cockroaches. Um, if you've seen her react it's to a cockroach, one of my fears. you would know that it, she's wrong. But I didn't write that. What I wrote write? getting cheated on. <sighs> that was the that was the serious <laughs> one. I should have maybe said both. You know what that means, guys? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I feel bad. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> <laughs> My pants. <laughs> I'm doing laundry today. <laughs> first one, good start. Good start, honey. My first question is, who kissed who first in our relationship? So, you kissed me first. Final answer. <laughs> yes, we're gonna do a demonstration. I only asked this question because I think it's really funny because I finally got the courage to kiss her and you have to do be true to that night. This is what it looked like. <sighs> this is his perspective, but it's not like this. This is exactly how it is. <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Just relax, relax. Mm. <laughs> that was it right there, that was good. It wasn't. She didn't kiss me back. Guys, don't so... you know the 90-10 <clears throat> rule? I went 110 and she went zero. <laughs> okay, next. All right, babe, next one. What household chore do I hate the most? I'll give you a tip because you just got pied. Um, it's like part of like cleaning Like routine. the cleaning routine. It's the floor the is cleaning. final answer. It's a deep cleaning routine. The floor is no! final answer. No! <laughs> <laughs> Honey, it's not the floor. Oh, I know. What? Folding the laundry. <laughs> Final answer. Oh my word. What it's did you say? It's the bathroom. I hate cleaning the I'm bathroom. I'm not getting tired for that. She's too smart for for this kind of thing. What she does is when she doesn't really doesn't want to do it, she puts it on me, and then she says, "Can you do this for me?" So I always do the lunches because she hates it, and I always do the floors because you hate it, and I always fold the laundry because that's her least favorite thing. I like folding, but I hate washing. So it's this Okay, I guess you're right. So if she really hated the bathroom that much, she would make me do it, but she's never made me do it once. Because it's that awful. No, 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 no. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Okay, whatever. I'll I know her one. better than she knows herself. You know, sometimes it's like that, so I'm gonna let I'm gonna let it pass. I'm gonna let go of the pride. I'll remember that as well. The grace. Yes. And the uh, please do the I'm... humility to know that you were wrong in that. Okay. <laughs> too far. Too far. Next. Next question. Okay. <clears throat> What is, oh sorry, I forgot to, what is your most annoying habit? My most annoying habit? Mm -hmm. Like something I do that's really annoying? Mm-hmm. So I'm the annoying person? Yes, you're the, you're the annoying person. What do you do that annoys me the most? Oh no, hmm. I'm just gonna start <laughs> loading this up. No! Is it when I tell you <laughs> I'm scared? An annoying habit, annoying habit, annoying habit. <laughs> when am I annoying? Why am I annoying? Think annoying, think annoying. Is it when I tell you you're on social media too much? Mm -mm. No! <laughs> I wrote down hogging the sheets at night. <laughs> no! There's no rule that I can wear a towel over my face when you call me. No! That annoys you, you've never told me. I tell you all the time. I say you took all the sovereign off. All the sovereign off. It's in your video, I think, at one point. Honey, I don't want to get pied. I wore makeup today. I'm going to let this slide. If she gets the rest of them right, I'm going to pie her. <laughs> Okay. For that one. That's my grace but one. But if not, that's your grace one. Okay. okay. I reserve the right to steal pie you. Sorry, it's still gonna be fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My turn. Okay, what is my biggest pet peeve? It's... I know this one. Okay. It's it's using your phone while you drive. No, honey. I know you better than you know yourself. No. My biggest pet peeve is... Something, I'll give you another clue. Something in the house. Worse than, it's, wait, it's worse than someone driving and texting and swerving and endangering because <laughs> you say Don't that justify. all the time. Uh, okay. It is one of my pet peeves, but I was thinking of something different in right. the house. Okay, so in the house. That I always fix every time I see it. Not doing the dishes right away. Letting the dishes sit in the sink. That's one of them. Yep, I we had a We had a fight about that. We did have a fight about Recently. that. <laughs> so I had two because I knew you were going to probably get one wrong. But the two, you're not going to get pie for this because you got one right, was dishes left in the sink overnight. Overnight, right. That's when we got in a fight. And leaving the shower curtain open. Okay, she does complain about that one. So that, now okay. you know. Yep. Good job, honey. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Number three for me. What is my go-to cheat meal? What is your go-to cheat meal? My go-to cheat meal. What do I eat when I can like indulge? Is it something that you buy outside? Yeah, not a home-cooked meal. It's not home-cooked. Mm -mm, no, because cheat meals for me are ones I don't have to make myself. See, my cheat meals are different, so. Right, I know. Oh, I know. Um, I'll say pizza. <laughs> no? No, you're gonna know right away. You're gonna be like, oh, no. I messed up. I'll give you one other chance. Oh, no. That's a good, I mean, pizza, I definitely love pizza. I so like I, it's hard to say you're wrong with that, but Wingstop? it's not what I wrote. That's another good one. I'll give oh, you, my God. Those, are, those are two of the three, but not Aww. my number one. I'm going to give you grace because I understand that I do ask for pizza and Wingstop a lot. But Chick-fil-A, oh, we had it cool. catered at our wedding because I'm so obsessed with the spicy Chick -fil chicken. Chick-fil-A considered... Is Chick-fil-A considered che like cheap? Fried chicken? Well, sometimes you can get a salad. buttered bread? <laughs> <laughs> Do I have, have you ever seen me get a salad, honey? Yes! <laughs> and the salad would not be cheap. <laughs> but I'll, great, I'll give grace because we can okay. stop. I bug you about that every single day of our lives. Guys, the goal is for me to not get pied only Will because I did my makeup. Okay, next question. What, who was my first celebrity crush growing up? <laughs> Like ever since I was a little girl, he's little a girl. he's a he's an actor. An actor. And I remember when I told you, you're like, oh, I know why. <laughs> <laughs> that means. I'll give you another hint. He's a nerdy guy. Mm, no, I don't know. I'll give you another hint. He um. 
He doesn't make movies anymore. At all. Never. And the reason he doesn't is because it's sad. <laughs> I know it. You've given me good clues. So I deserve pie if this is wrong. Okay. The, I, I think this is his name. He's in um, Fast and Furious, yeah. Paul Walker. Yeah. Okay. Because like if you were like yeah, because remember 14 told you. or 15, I could have said someone like... Um, so you said like Chris Brown. Right, exactly. Chris Brown was but the one I But I used to have say. like literally a poster of Paul Walker in my room. Mm -hmm. So big crush, but he died. So mm -hmm. it's sad. Okay. <clears throat> this question... This one is the softball question. This is like the one that I gave her in case she got all of these pie, or like pie in the face. Oh, I just okay. one she would get right. Okay. Um, what was the first meal I ever cooked for you? And mm. because this is so easy, you have to be very specific. Okay, I'll never forget this one because this is how I knew I really liked him. <laughs> so I had posted on Instagram like, oh, I'm sick. And then he was like, Oh, I don't feel good either. And he like DM'd me. He's like, I'll make you, I'm making chicken noodle soup and I'll make you a batch if you want and I'll come bring it to your house. And I was like, oh, that's so nice. And I was like, and she took me up on it because I, did. People, I thought for sure no one would take me up on that. Yeah. Like, so I did. And then I was like, wait, I'm keto friendly at the moment. So then I was like, I can only have chicken soup, not chicken noodle soup. <laughs> Who does that? That mm -hmm. sounds awful. <laughs> it, <laughs> it was really good though. <laughs> But he brought it and he made two separate batches, one just chicken soup and then he made himself chicken noodle soup. And then he got a lot of good points from that one. It was very kind. I dropped it off and I was too nervous to say anything. I was like, and here you go, like goodbye. Left it ran away and I was like, oh. I carried this and hot, he's nerdy. boiling hot soup, all like <laughs> two city blocks. <laughs> and you were all nerdy mm. and cute. I like nerds. Anyways, that was it, and now we like to have it for like date nights and stuff. It's really special. I like a cold day. Cold day, yeah. Cold rainy day. It's a good one. Oh, I just asked a question. Your oh, yes, turn. my turn. Okay, next question. Um, where did we take our first picture together? I know this one. I know I'm right. And so <laughs> if, you, if we have all of the time signatures for this. Oh, my gosh. Uh, the, first, the first time we ever took a picture together was in Darling Harbor mm. at the Pixar. There was like a pop-up Pixar putt-putt. It was, putt. playing putt -putt. It mm -hmm. was one of our like fifth, first like official dates. Yeah, and I had, it was right by my work and I had passed it every day and I was like, that would be such a good date spot. This is it. Oh my gosh. There it is. Look at how cute and awkward we are. <laughs> it was such a cool putt-putt too. Yeah. I love golf and that so. That was fun. Um, that was very fun. All right. This one is well, this one's pretty easy. I regret making them too easy, <clears throat> but what was the very first movie we watched together in the theater? Um, this one for sure, no grace. If you don't get this right, pie. It was Bohemian Rhapsody. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. good. Indeed. We watched a lot of movies in that time, mm -hmm. RIP movie theaters in California. Sad. <laughs> but oh. I... Um, I was I was wondering maybe if she would mix up because we watched like Dumbo at that time and we watched. Oh yeah, um, no, that was the first one because yeah. you were all nervous to ask me out. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I was like, is this too weird of a movie to ask for like, at first? It was a really good movie. Yeah, it was really good. Okay, this is my last question. Mm. <sighs> what is my favorite childhood memory? I. Pie, 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 <laughs> pie. <laughs> I, it's because we're do, doing this soon. This is why I'm guessing it. <laughs> you, I, um, you have said that going to like a cabin with your family, like mm -hmm. family trips to a cabin. I don't remember the city, but yeah, somewhere in El Paso area. I get. I'm guessing, mm -hmm. but like a uh, cabin in the woods with the family. Yes. Final answer. Good job, honey. We're doing that soon. Going to Pine Top. Yes, we're going to Pine Top. Very exciting. We're so excited. I haven't done that since I was quite young so it's been a while mm. yay all right you have the last question this is the last question if i don't get pied i'm so happy if she if she gets this right guys she gets pied either way <laughs> no okay what was my favorite <laughs> book of 2020 okay i'm gonna guess i've read 35 books this year He's and a book I've, I've talked to her extensively about too many of them and i've bored her to death and tried to get her to read some you, you've done you've read some too it's good mm -hmm. but He's like the biggest bookworm. He like any spare time he'll read a book either on audio or 
actual paperback. Mm -hmm. So it's very overwhelming. So I'm probably going to get this. One I'm going to give her two. There's, there's one of two answers that she can do to help. Cause I honestly had a hard time picking my favorite book of okay. the year. So I have <laughs> two options. I'm going to show you that I wrote it down Two. Natalie. Okay, I'm gonna guess leadership and, and deception. Mm -mm. No? <gasps> he actually didn't get it wrong. I read that uh, last last year <laughs> and I read it. That is one of my favorite books of all time because no! I read it every year since then. This is my third or fourth time reading through it, but it's not my favorite book of this year. Okay, so that's half of the answer. No. You said you're gonna give me two ends. You're gonna give me two no, options. No, I'm gonna give you. All right, oh, that's fine. I'll okay. do that. My next one is the body keeps the score. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> I knew that one because he's obsessed with that one. It's such, it changed my life because it's about how we deal with and cope with our traumas. Yeah. And it helped me understand myself and her mm -hmm. and everyone else that I meet so yes. much better. So I definitely knew that was one. Mm -hmm. I talked about that, that all the time. It changed our relationship actually. It really yeah, did. It did. It helped us understand each other. Highly recommend it. The body keeps the score. Incredible. You won't regret it. It's really sad though. So I didn't so. get pied. <sighs> what are we gonna do with? <laughs> it got runny. <laughs> it's going all the way down my belly button. <laughs> I did not expect to be so runny. I'm so hard. <laughs> I'm crying. Oh. Honey, I look at it. Here you go, honey. It's in my belly button creases. It looks like I just threw up all over myself. <laughs> that is so sweet. Can you pull my hair back? You got me. <laughs> look at my pants. Oh my word. It's in your hair. Honey, that was the number one rule to not get it in my hair. I didn't know it was gonna get, it was just sitting here and it lost its consistency. It's probably because it was $1. <laughs> no, this is, this is quality. <laughs> I win! <laughs> oh my gosh, babe. What the heck? Well, guys, I hope that was fun and you got to know both of us a little bit more and we actually got to know each other a bit more because he got a lot wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys have the best weekend and... The best New Year. The best New ever. Year's. And don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> don't forget to... <laughs> subscribe and <laughs> give it a thumbs up and leave a comment because I really appreciate those. I'll see you guys in two weeks because next week I'm going on a girl's trip with my sisters for my birthday. I'm gonna be 25. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm gonna be 31. <laughs> Anyways, love you guys. Have a good weekend. Bye. Bye.